Well, now check this out. I got this doggone ferrite rod I've been playing with uh, a while ago. Uh, it's about eh, that's about eight to ten inches long, I guess. I wound it. Uh, don't ask me how many turns are on here, but I've got one set of turns underneath practically the length of the rod and I've got this on top and I'm in using those are the inputs there's one input there's the other I'm using this in a uh, by filler type you got two spools uh, 20 uh, what is it 20 4 gauge 24 gauge wire in a bifiller arrangement and uh, we're getting 720 volts uh, now that's with the load on there this is the ferrite it's lit it's it's kind of dim I mean it's not bad F okay 70 730 this is adjustable now and it kind of helps uh, sitting oh it's probably about a half inch inside that's where the top is at the rest of it's filled it's about a half inch inside of here where the top is at it's somewhere in here the top and the rest of it is the, the rod and yeah I don't know how many winds I have on this on the inside I don't know how many I've got on the outside here I was figuring something but anyway it's a ferrite rod it's not exactly the highest frequency rod they make but yeah seven uh, 730 730 volts with the load take the load off you'll go up to 800 volts now it took a while to dial this thing in apparently the uh, the software you can set it hit your that you hit the uh, you hit your noise but if you crank your amplitude all the way up it'll send a noise signal to whatever you want at this volume and it, the more you go up the higher the frequency goes up which isn't necessarily uh, the correct frequency so it'll put you in the neighborhood Uh, it'll put you in the neighborhood and that's about it now we're at 810 volts no load 820 why does it sound like my hard drive is doing a lot of work over there Or is that just the fan? I hope it's the fan. So with a load 720, 730, I have still been dialing this thing in a bit. Uh -huh. So I find that interesting. I've got me an adjustable core at least. It's uh, it's only uh, you know, eight, seven, eight, nine, ten, six hundred volts less than the uh, the bigger ferrite here.
but it uh, it lights up the bulb a bit better this is using bigger wire around the core this like I said is 22 gauge I think it is that's that can't be right it's a 24 gauge so this is 24 this was probably 18 gauge I'm imagining I'm guessing 18 gauge on that I'm guessing 18 this is 24 so I'm using a heavier wire I'm getting uh, I should say there you go I'm getting a better current I don't know about the nano pulses here let me look Sixty. Yeah, I've got the nano pulses too. But it basically looks the uh, same. Well, I got twenty volts. No, one thirty. Hundred and thirty volt nanos. At one ten. In that area. No, 60 to 130. Uh, some sharp peaks. This is not quite as high as the big ferrite. So these could be in the lower 100 megahertz region, I'm guessing. Oh, there's some. They're, they're not as long and as sharp as the other one. But they're there. I just find this all interesting. I don't want that. Okay. Seven forty. It's okay, there's those again. Yeah, that's, uh, so that other one is setting at 82 kilohertz. This, the other one is, come on, there you go. The other one is running 80 point, it's running 80.7. 80.7 and 82. Right, can you see that? Yeah, 80.7 on the uh, Viz and uh, 82 on this one. So there's about a one uh, <laughs> one kilohertz. That uh, went through that one. Uh, yeah, it's just 300 cycles, whatever difference. Yeah, about a 300 cycle combined together. Yeah, working together. That's 80.15. So it's about 1.1 kilohertz off. So yeah, they uh, got to kind of work together. Seven forty volts. Yeah, I guess it could be dialed in a little bit. Seven hundred and fifty volts. My light's not on. Turn up. All right, what happened? Something come unplugged. There. Huh? trying okay it's probably starting to drift again here okay there's seven seventy yeah the uh, drifting it's 
really getting kind of tight. There's 770. Well, something, something's drifting, I'm sure. So that's, uh, oh, put these back together. There it goes. My coils were coming apart here. Oh, it's up to 820 now. Oop, just went down. There it goes. Okay, 7, 40, 50. Yeah, I guess I'll have to do something with that. So, uh, 7, 40. With the light semi-lit. I can see it. It's dim. Kind of dim, but it's not bad. Isn't that interesting? <laughs>